iOS does a good job of logging diagnostic and usage data to your device. For instance, if you have a low memory error or a particular app crashes on you, then it will create a log and log it right here under diagnostic and usage data, which is in the general and then the about section and diagnostics and usage section. And this contains, as you see, all the various crashes, low memory warnings and things pertaining to particular apps. But as you can see, it's quite a lot of information there. It would be nice to be able to remove this easily. Unfortunately, the only way to actually do that is by syncing and copying all this information over to iTunes. So really that is the only way that we found at least to get all this data off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start a sync with iTunes right now. And then you'll see in my status bar on my device, you'll see the little sync logo uh, pop up showing that the sync is being performed right there. So you see it right there in the upper right hand corner next to the clock. And that syncing is going on, and right now it's actually copying the diagnostic and usage data. You actually can see it. I should have shown that to you, but you can actually see in iTunes, it tells you copying diagnostic and usage data. So once it copies it all over, it deletes it from your iOS device so that it's not taking up a lot of space, and then you just get a clean slate. Uh, so in a second, we'll check diagnostics and usage data, and it should be blank. It should be empty, and we'll just let this finish syncing here. Now it should be done. And there you go, no diagnostic data because it's all copied over and deleted off your device. Hope this was able to help you out. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.